Welcome back to In Focus. It has been said, when you educate a girl, you educate the next generation. Kianda Foundation in Kenya is doing exactly that by providing useful training to girls from very poor families. Freshly pressed fruit juice, a large plate of fruit salad, and some sizzling baked tender ribs are only a sampling of what is served by Kimlea's kitchen. The girls here are training in catering, part of a program at Kimlea's Girls Technical Training Center in Limuru, just outside of Kenya's capital, Nairobi. Founded 17 years ago by a non-profit organization, the center helps girls from poor families acquire skills that prepare them for a better future. Frankie Gikandi is the founder and principal of Kimlea Center. She says the center's objective is to promote education among girls and women from low-income families, and particularly those who work in the nearby tea and coffee plantations. It started on a part-time basis, part basis, then we made it a full-time full -time program and uh, encouraged the, the, the parents to send their girls um, who would otherwise have uh, gone back to the plantations to work like their parents and the cycle of poverty continues in the sense that each girl goes to work and um, uh, where the mothers uh, work and eventually gets married. Besides cookery, the center also offers courses in tailoring and dressmaking, machine and hand knitting, housekeeping and laundry. After a year of training, the students spend the next year learning how to market and sell their products. Again, Frankie Gikandi. They do everything with the idea of selling whatever they produce, whether it is a cake they have baked, some biscuits they have cooked, or a dress they have made, or on, on a cardigan they have knitted, a sweater they have knitted. Eunice Chipkimoy is a first-year student at Kimlea. She is one of six siblings, and her mother is a plantation laborer, earning about $2 a day. With the skills she is acquiring at Kimlea Training Center, Chef Kimboy looks to the future with great optimism. Well, after I finish school, um, maybe I can get a job. And after working for maybe some few months and get enough money, maybe I can, save it. I can be self-employed. Kimlea has turned out more than a thousand graduates who have gone on to find jobs and started up their own businesses. Paris Wenjiko is a graduate of Kimlea and has been teaching at her former school for the past six years. It was a bit difficult for my parents to, to educate me further because um, I am the second in a family of six. So my parents um, and I agreed that I was going, going, uh, I was going to, to study in Kimlea, so I completed my course and uh, I got a job as a, an assistant teacher. To qualify for admission to Kimlea, a girl has to come from a poor family and prove that she cannot raise the monthly fee of about 40 US dollars. Those who can afford are asked to pay just a tenth of that amount, which is equivalent to their parents' day's wage. The rest of the money comes from donors. Vincent McCory, VOA News.